Hello and welcome to another spooky demo from Steam Next Fest of October 2022. This game is called In the Workplace of Madness. I'm not sure what that red text is where it says that my video memory has been exhausted. Expect extremely poor performance. I don't have that message anywhere else. It's literally just in the game screen. So either that means the game doesn't like my computer or vice versa. So we're going to give this a try and we're going to see if we can actually play this. Movement is Baza. Hooray. This is a basic test to showcase the art style and player movements of the game by allowing you to explore the meeting room and examine multiple things. This demo does not represent the final version of the game as it is subject to change. Feel free to investigate and once you are finished, you may exit the demo by going through the same door you entered through. The meeting room. A lot of heated arguments about work happened here. I'm not happy our boss has died, <laughs> but I sure won't miss those days of working with him. It's walking on its own. I'm not doing anything. Stephanie said that the exit key is in the safe here. I just need to get it opened. Am I moving now? Oh, I'm moving. Okay. This is the safe over here, right? Safe is locked by a key code. Why did that... Oh, that's the gun. Okay. Weird. I guess I had to load in. Okay, how do I get the key code? James Chrysler, founder and CEO of Prismacare Insurance and a few defunct establishments, has died age 46. The successful businessman died after falling from the roof of the sixth floor Bridgegate office complex building while taking a cigarette break, his employees told the news informer. Police have ruled out the possibility of a murder and have concluded the death as an accident as there is no evidence that points out that Chrysler was suicidal or that he had any issues. Some of his employees pointed out that suicide is possible as only one of his companies hadn't yet been closed due to bankruptcy like the others. His wife Karen, however, claimed that James did not care too much about losing money as he was a very down-to-earth man. Karen Chrysler has sworn to keep his last establishment running to preserve his legacy and hard work. I'm bad. I'm not good with Wazda. Have I mentioned that? No? That's a door. I was trying to look at this. The last meeting was about individual health insurance. It was Mr. Chrysler's last meeting before his death. This is so weird. It's like a combination of photorealistic and pixel art. Okay, we just, we already had that conversation. Where do I find the key, the code for this? I guess I just go out that door and see what happens? Or am I going to inadvertently exit the demo? Okay, that's the gun. Why can't I go out the door? Okay, I'm clicking up the left mouse button. I'm holding the mouse button. There we go. Okay. Okay, we reopened the demo. Uh, we're gonna see if I've missed anything. I get that it's supposed to be basic, but that's a little more basic than I would have anticipated. So maybe I missed something. Okay. I do like the art style. I just wish, oh, there's something here we didn't look at. A Renaissance painting depicting the Annunciation and Expulsion from Paradise. Okay. I really like the mixture of like photorealistic and, and pixel art. But this demo is leaving a lot to be desired if all it is is to walk around and look at pictures. Shakespearean painting depicting Coriolanus taking leave of his family. I don't know what any of that is, but okay. Excuse me. Okay, I'm clicking. Oh, that was my gun. I wasn't trying to get the gun out. It's saying look here, but there. Oops, this presentation monitor was something or other. It was, if I was the one paying electricity bills, I would have fired them. I guess it was just left on. That's what he said. Okay. So, here, papers and folders with plans on upcoming health insurance plans. I guess all of that has been delayed until we have a new manager. I mean, fair. Nothing there. Oop. Okay. So there's nothing to, like, let you at least play the game a little bit. Like, when they said this is to showcase the art style and the movement, that's literally all, all it is. And that's disappointing because I was looking forward to playing this. It looks really interesting. I really like the art style. So I might still make this into a video even though it's very short because there's nothing else to do as far as I can tell. We already looked at that. We already looked at that. I'm just going to wander a little bit more. Can't do anything there. I think this looks like it has a lot of potential. It's just disappointing that they didn't put more into the demo. But it may be a game that is still in very early development. Who knows? 
But like, I just love this art style, like more than I thought I would from the trailer. This is just, like so cool. And the story from the trailer seems really cool. It's really disappointing that you couldn't at least go to one other room and do something or unlock the safe, find the thing and unlock the safe. Now I am bad at video games, so maybe there is a way to unlock the safe and I just can't find the code somewhere. It is distinctly possible. I was kind of hoping maybe it would be on this table, but it's not. So yeah, this has been the extremely short playthrough of the extremely short demo of In the Workplace of Madness. I do very much want to see more from this game. It will stay on my wish list, despite how small this demo is. If only because the art style is really freaking cool. You can check it out for yourself if you want. If you find something that I didn't, please let me know. Because I'm probably just very stupid and walking right past the combo for the safe. I'll just put this up because I think this game looks like it will be cool. Thanks so much for hanging out. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment, all that good stuff. For the algorithm, we must feed the algorithm. And I will see you next time. Bye!